All right, welcome to episode six of the Guardian Gauntlet, and we're up against someone that is skipping bands. So you guys know what that means. They're probably gonna play something OP. Oh, let me put that on D and D real quick. There we go. Yeah, I gotta. I I I would Dante a game, so I gotta one v one him. But first, we gotta record this game. So, let's see. So he he banned nobody. Okay, cool. Okay, let's see our options. Vulcan's open. Uller's open. Boxer is open. AMC's open, and Anubis is open. And I gotta play Bacchus. Part of me is tempted to just not play Bacchus and play Ymir and do this as a full gameplay as something else. Like, not a part of the series just because they skip bands. But at the same time... Bac Bacchus has mitigation, which mitigates true damage. So maybe he'd do okay into Bacchus here. And by okay, I mean horribly. But the still. king, baby! Is Bar Wait, I gotta double check with Bacchus who I gotta play. So we won with Ares, Ardeo, Athena. So yeah, Bacchus. Let's go. Okay, so... We did manage to uh, <laughs> to get a game. It, it's Rexy playing Hamesy. <laughs> oh my god, it's okay. I've won this. Oh, once, so obviously I can do it again. <laughs> okay, yeah, we're against Rexy, so. Chances of winning have gone down dramatically. Kind of glad I didn't go you here. That would have been a bad idea. Okay, let's go... Ooh, racer. Actually, we can get one more drink. Minions have spawned. <laughs> okay, this is... Bacchus is really bad, you guys. All right. Okay, and AMC is really good, and it's a good player in AMC, so I'm a little scared. Let's go. Let's go. You take that minion aggro to group up the minions for my leap. Okay. Okay, we outcleared AMC. The prophecy is true. I took minis. Okay, good. Too bad I used my uh I used my two so I couldn't use it on the minions there. Just trying to poke him down. It's not working very well though. I will hit level 5 a tiny bit before him, and we might have come with that. He does have shell, though. I have brace. But if he clears a wave before me, then, you know, it's not really going to work. Oh, no, I didn't hit him with my 2. Okay, that's bad. We're, probably dead. We're either dead or he's just got his ultimate. Okay. Okay, okay. Now, do I stay or do I go? Can't pick up his stinger. Good. That's good for me. That's like really good for me. I have my ult, and I know he's gonna shell the second I leap on him. So what I do gotta do is I gotta stun him, then leap on him so he can't activate shell. That's the only way I kill him here. Oh, he activates shell anyways. Okay, cool. <laughs> no, please. Okay. I don't have enough mana for my two and ultimate. So, he's just gonna back. Let's go back too. That way we can contest red. We'll get boots and like two mana potions, one health potion. I usually don't buy potions, but Bacchus' sustain is so bad. I've tried like every start in the book with Bacchus. I would say Warrior's Blessing seems to be the best, just because he doesn't get poked out as hard. He still has mana issues, but Warrior's Blessing, the procs, you know, can help him sustain at least a little bit. I do... Oh, I didn't think he was taking that. I thought he went for his blue buff for some reason. I 
could have stolen that. Uh, I do think Specialist Blessing has some merit on, ba on Bacchus, but the problem is that he will still get outpoked. And it doesn't matter if he has mana if he's going to be outpoked. The buff to Bacchus 1 was huge, though. Made him at least slightly viable. And he has viable as Guardians can get. Oh, yeah. That's how Warriors Blessing evolves, so that'll help us a lot. A lot, a lot. You get more stacks on Warriors Blessing. Dang it. <laughs> yeah, unfortunately, here's the thing. When I get crippled, I can't use my two, which is my escape. And... I, it's also just happens to be my highest damaging ability. So cripples against Bach is very good. It's like if it was just my escape, that wouldn't be so bad. But it's, it's, since it's my highest damaging ability, I can't really turn on him when I heal to him. Which, you know, is pretty problematic. The hives are pretty cool on that skin. Alright, uh, might be able to get tier 2 Bancrofts pretty soon. He does have his Stinger back, so he has his ult, which, you know, sucks for me. I kind of want a Chalice, but we can always get what we want. Yeah, no, this is... I'm just getting one shot, you guys. His ultimate does 265. I could get a chalice, but I don't know how much it'll help me. And then getting one Blitz shot. As usual, I would probably go Nimean in this matchup just to reflect, you know. Reflect some of his damage back to him. Since I'm a magical god, it reflects physical damage. I'm only one level behind, so at least the XP difference isn't that big right now. However, he can kill me off cooldown with his ultimate right now, which is pretty scary. Okay, let's clear this way. Always staying for one more wave. Nope. <laughs> Dang it, I was hoping I was hoping he would actually go for the red buff or that I'd be able to stun him for literally anything. I think that might be an F6 or I'll just stay in this game for the heck of it though, because I know he needs a he needs a good 10 minute video. I know it's bad when people are early surrender. Now who knows, maybe we'll get that return kill. That return kill and duels everything. And we got pretty close there. And Bacchus wants to get the build online. He's not that bad. I've had a full gameplay against a bad AMC and I won late game. But that was because they were a bad AMC. I don't think I have my warriors stacked yet. I wonder how far my three could be hear, heard across the map. Like, if I'm using it at XP camps, can he, he hear that from, like, his blue buff? Probably, huh? We should probably put some points in our one for some protections. And my two actually clears the wave now. Nice. I haven't gotten to use my ult once this game, effectively. Which kind of sucks. Please don't steal this. Please don't steal this. I will alt to secure this. Alright, cool. Okay, I think that's gonna be a brawlers for my for my bracer. Blitzed as usual. Alright, at least we got some decent shoes. My two, my three and two could probably kill him. The thing is that he does a little bit too much damage right now. Freak out. Freak. I 
Dang it. I had my bracer, but I can't use my bracer while channeling my three. Oh, I was really hoping my two would hit, but AMC's move speed is so fast. Like, he was going in and out of tower, and there wasn't really any good time to jump in because of how fast AMC is. He can just step back. tipsy right now. We need another drink. The thing about Guardians is uh, I can't kill the hives easily either. Like, he literally just replaced the hive I just placed. Or I just killed. Alright. Oh, you got, got Crusher. He didn't get... He didn't get brawlers. That's good for me. That's actually really good for me. Okay. So my bracer can actually still save my life if I'm able to use it properly. We need some cooldown. Like maybe Chronos Pennant? I don't know. A three has anti-heal, which is pretty helpful, but it's not the best thing in the world. Kinda wanna catch him out. Or at least try. Did he recall? Looks like he recalled. Dang, man, that sucks. Could have taken those minions faster. We need cooldown, but I need Nemean more. So we'll still get Nemean. We have Thorns now, too? You got Blink. Uh oh. My spirit mages. He's pretty low. That's low though. He's going after my blue buff. I'll go after my blue buff. Oh, he already took my blue buff. Okay. <laughs> okay. I just heard him place a hive. Oh. Dang it, man. Oh, there's nothing I can do. I needed to know where he is. I These mana potions didn't even help me, by the way. Because I'm dying before I even have my mana issues. Normally, Fox has mana issues, but I'm dying before I can even use my potions. Usually, I have that area warded, but I didn't this time because I hadn't used my, my mana potions yet. That sucks. That sucks because he was actually low enough to the point where I could have killed him. Now we're three levels behind. Now that's the difference. can't really give up <laughs> okay we can't looks like he's skipping defense I don't know if he's doing that on purpose he's probably doing that on purpose just to try and give me a, a chance probably but even so I can probably get one kill and then that's it Oh, my bracer just came up. I was spamming my bracer as fast as I could. <laughs> I haven't been ulting because I don't want to ult unless I can guarantee a kill. And there, I was just trying to bracer as hard as I could. And I couldn't. That bracer would have saved my life ten times over. Oh, that's a game. GG. <laughs> what? No! No, what? No. <laughs> don't <laughs> I don't... I don't deserve it. <laughs> I didn't even get a kill. 
Well, shoot. <laughs> he has six for me. That's really nice of him. But I don't know if that counts for the Guardian Gauntlet or not. I went 0 6. I don't think that counts. <laughs> oh, my lord. Thank, thank you. I don't know how to feel. I didn't get one. One kill. Wait, I should. Rex is a good guy, you guys. You guys should check out his channel. He has a YouTube channel uploads two videos daily. Uh, I'm just going to say... I, I don't know. I'll leave it up to the comments. I'll just put a straw poll and I'll say whether this counts or not. I think that's the easiest way. So do I have to replay Bacchus or does it count? <laughs> I, was, I, I don't know. So let me know in the comments. All right, everybody have a good day. Thank you for watching.